This Windows 10 video demonstrates how to disable hibernation. Desktop or tower computers don't require hibernation. Laptops use it during low battery events. The advantages of disabling on desktops include gaining 6 to 12 gigabytes of hard drive space, less file system fragmentation, and improved system repairability. Open your file explorer and select your C drive. This is where the hibernation file will be stored, but it is hidden. Now click on View. Go to Options. Click the View tab and put a check mark in front of Show Hidden Files, Uncheck Hide Extensions, and Uncheck Hide Protected Operating System Files click yes on the warning and then click OK to reveal the hibernation file. In this example it is 6.6 .6 gigabytes in size. It varies from system to system. Now right click your start menu, select power options and go to additional power settings. Click choose what the power buttons do and you will see a little known Windows 10 feature which is called turn on fast startup. Uncheck this because it uses hibernation which we are about to disable. Click save changes and exit out of these menus. Open file explorer and we're just going to monitor this file. From Cortana Type in CMD. On the command prompt line, right click and select Run as Administrator. We are now going to type the command to disable hibernation. It is powerconfig minus H off. You can copy and paste this directly in the DOS box. As soon as it's executed, you'll notice the hibernation file disappears from the list. This is the only way to destroy that file while the system is running. If you wanted to re-enable hibernation, the command is right there on the screen. Now that we have disabled hibernation, we should put back the file folder options. Go to view, options, view again, and put the check marks back where they were previously, or customize these settings to your liking. Disabling hibernation isn't for everyone, but now you have the option.